What's up, guys? Desert B here with more Sinking City. We're starting here in an underwater dive section. We're we're looking for the the K fingers, the pieces of the seal that we have, and so we're right next to, or well, we should be, you know, sort of close to uh, one of the monoliths, and then. The guy who let us use his dive spot, he had asked us, oh man, fall damage. Hold on, we gotta pressurize. The guy had asked us to place these grave markers where his family's bodies are down here because his family, well, they all got lost at sea and then they went crazy and decided to just walk off the edge of the boat and they decided they were gonna I don't know. Test their luck, I guess, out here in the... Whoa! Oh my god, I love these. Look at that giant ship. That is wild. It's a Titanic. Oh, there's another one. Okay, so, um, how do we find the bodies? And surely, we're not going down there, are we? Nah, there's no way. But this is where the marked path led me, so I... Oh, we go this way. I see. I wish I could run underwater. Or somehow move faster than I am currently moving. No, let me m maybe get my armed and like ready. Underwater combat in this game is just far from ideal. Wait a minute, this is where I came from, is it not? Okay, hold on. Where do I go? I feel like I'm lost. Oh, maybe I go... Yeah, this is the cliff. Okay, we go this way. I got turned around. The Archie. Okay, so that's the... That's the guy's ship that... Let me use his dive spot. It's kind of odd that you can't... Like, uh... That Charles won't... Aw, oh, crap. Come at me, bro. Oh, that was the wrong weapon. Ah! I'm gonna die. That's all there is to it. We're gonna die. Ouchie. Okay, pressurize. Can I back out of here? Well, he despawned or something happened because... He's gone. I d how am I supposed to function? This is ridiculous. You can't kill them, that's the problem. So, like, no matter what I do, it's not gonna go away. Okay, so, which- this is the flare gun, right? Now what's this? That's the flare. But oh, which one's the harpoon? Because the harpoon is the one that- It's gotta be this one. The harpoon is the one that actually st stuns it. The flare gun only... Why are they both acting like they're a, like they're a flare gun? I don't know. Okay, well I don't see it, but here's one of the family members. I thought that they... Why is he tied to a rock? I thought that they just walked off the ship and sank to the bottom. Almost seems to me like... He killed his family. Okay, there's that sea monster again. I don't know, I'm just gonna have to work around it maybe and... Try not to get spotted.
I don't know how many family members he had. I hope it was only like three. Something manageable. Except I'm not seeing any more. And where's the monolith? Oh great, I lost the fish. I think he's way over there. Oh yeah, okay. So it would be safe for me. We'll try and look for bodies. Oh god, no, he's gonna see me. Where are the other bodies? And another question that I have is where's the monolith? Maybe I'm supposed to just keep going forward. I'm not sure. This green light is calling to me. Okay, the fish is way over there. Oh, here's a body. Okay, good. This is grotesque. Neither alive nor dead. Really? It looks pretty dead to me. Oh, well here's the um the thing. Got it. What happened? Oh, I guess I don't get to do the other crosses. Oh. Well, I guess I got two of them done. I didn't realize that it was gonna... fast track me out of there. Where did I come up? Okay, I'm back in the guy's apartment. The seal is complete. Now I can open the central monolith and descend into Katiganor. This ancient, otherworldly artifact was found by Throgmorton's expedition to the depths beneath Oakmont. The seal was used in rituals by those who lived here in ancient times before the city was even founded. Where's the, uh... No one left in the... Wait, what is... Is this the right one? Cemetery guard? No, that's not it. Bounty of the Sea. I was looking for the quest where the guy had asked me. I don't know, maybe I did it. Three. See, and I only did two. I kind of feel bad. I don't think any of these match. Just wanted to check, though. So, I can open the central monolith. Now, was the central monolith the very first one I went to, maybe? I didn't find all your relatives. You asked. Oh, what? man. But you promised. I know, I suck. I tried, but failed. I really tried to find them. But it's not safe, and I was running out of time, Mom. I'm sorry. I... I understand. You tried, and that's what matters. I, I'm sorry. I... I had no right to endanger you. It's okay. You just wanted to help your family. Nevertheless, please take this as my apology. And oh, wow. thank you again. Bye. I got... Oh, wow. He gave me a bunch of ammo. Dang. Okay. Wait a minute. How do I get out of here? You want to open the front door for me? There? How did I get in here? I must have climbed a window or something. I never could get in. Wait a minute. I thought this was locked before. Oh, maybe it was. Whatever. Let's get out of here. Okay, key evidence collected. That's fine. So, let's go back to the central monolith and see what the heck's gonna happen. How do I... What's the fastest way to get there? 
I guess, you know, if I was going to wrap up any side quests, I guess this would be the time to do it. But the real question is, do I really want to do any of these? Like, I don't want to do the tomes or the letters. Those are, you don't get any kind of a story or anything. It's literally just pick up a letter or pick up a book and go. Um, there was this. I'm in danger. I managed to procure one of the gold trinkets, which has made me the target of the fishmen. I'm being watched and followed. Send an armed escort so that I can be transported to the safety of the police department. My house is in, house is in South Advent on Purity Road. So, like, something like that I might do. Um, I never did finish that thing for that guy. He wanted me to put incense in these houses for some reason. Uh, I never finished these. St. Michael's Church, the Fish Market, University. What was this? Oh yeah, this is I had to find a ship. All that glitters. Conspiracy brewing. It's the fishmen. I know you couldn't confirm my previous reports, but this time it's different. Their rancid underwater gold has been surfacing around the city. Soon they'll have enough to buy out everybody. So that would be a whole bunch of stuff. Jacob Tucker? Oh yeah, that guy wanted me to find his sister. That's kind of sad. And then the guy in the graveyard. Hmm, do I want to do any of these? Let me try doing the fool's gold. I mean, that at least kind of sounds interesting. Advent. Advent. Where's Advent? Up here. Southern Advent. Purity Road. Oh, look, I think I already have it here. Between Michaels and Powder House. Okay. Okay, I need to find a fast travel. Let's go check that out. Kind of sounds like it's a psycho. Thinking that they're trapped or somehow like people are after them. We shall see. Oh my God, calm down. Should I intervene? Oh. Oh! What? What happened? Why did my sanity just get sucked right out of me? Okay, note to self, I guess don't help the townspeople? That was random. Hey. Hey. Oh, am I in hell? Why is the sky green? What the heck? It wasn't like this before. Oh man. Okay, let's go to the... We'll stop right here by the fish market because there was that historical thing at the fish market. And then... We'll go uh, try to save this person. Why is the sky green? Is it because I have... The pieces of the... The fish market you see now was sponsored by the generous Blackwood family and maintained by the Honorable Marsh family from Innsmouth. Yeah, these are easy. And they give us a little bit of history. What are you doing? You can't just kill us all. That's our market. Oh man, the Innsmouthers came in here and murdered everybody and took over? Blackwoods will continue to support the Innsmouthers, and we expect the Marsh family to keep their word, too. Jeez. Okay, where's the last? Is that it over there? Being good Christians, we're giving the Innsmouth refugees a chance to earn their bread. So pack up and leave the fish market. Time to figure this out. So probably Being here? Good Christians, we're giving the Innsmouth refugees... What are you doing? And then maybe this you can't one? just kill us all. 
That's on. The Black Hoods Oops. will continue to support the Innsmouthers, and we expect the Marsh family to keep their word too. The Innsmouthers took over the fish market with the help of the Blackwoods, who cut a tidy deal with the marshes. Okay. Well, that's the history of the fish market. Alright, well that's cool. We got that off of the list, so I need to actually turn around. I need my sanity to come back, please. Look at the sky. And there's that big old monolith. Just glistening in the moonlight. The music is all weird and scary now, too. Maybe this is not the ideal time to be running around through the city. It does look really cool, though. Makes the buildings stand out much differently than they normally do. Um. Yeah, let me go straight. I don't want to run into any infested areas. Wow, check that out. The boneyard. Do the people in the town not see the green in the sky? All right, so here's a dock. Maybe this is it. What kind of weapons do I have? Oh, that one guy just gave me a whole ton of ammo, which is concerning. I don't really expect there to be a fight at the end of the game, necessarily. I mean... I guess I really don't know what's coming, to be honest. What is that? Health kit? Or it's uh, anti-psychotics is what it is. Holy. Why you gotta scare me like that? Oh. Oh! Since when can that happen? Hello. Hello. Oh my god. Oh my god. Where'd it go? Come on. I have much bigger problems. I gotta heal. Who is shooting me? I don't see anything. Oh, it's like a ghost. Where is it? I cannot see. Can I just like... Oh, I see it now, I see it. Or I did. My god. That was... Couldn't see anything. Give me an antipsychotic and give me that. Jeez. Alright. What can I craft? Some of them. None of that. I can craft one of these. I use like all of my health kits just now. That was wild. And speaking of, let's use another. Okay, that's fine. Now, is there supposed to be somebody here? I thought somebody needed saving and escorted to the police. I don't see a letter or a body. Let me go upstairs.
Hello. Oh man. He's already a goner. But I feel like Flat Earth disproven. <laughs> the ocean would drain way too fast. Hollow Earth disproven. If the ground is hollow, how come it doesn't ring when I stomp on it? The fishmen, goodness, just to walk outside. They have flooded the city, the rest of America too, most likely. But Kay, what if I've been replaced too? Could it be why I'm allergic to tuna? <laughs> what? Oh, what? What happened? I just got a bunch of stuff. I tried to come in here to clear a side quest and I just gained myself a whole... Oh. Wow. What? Strong boxes in this place still haven't been cracked. So this is all probably just loot. Wow. All right. Well. What? There we go. Oh, God, I almost fell in. Um, okay. What's that? A first aid. Thank you. Yeah, it specifically said... What? What is flashing? A gorgeous pin shaped like coral carved out of a large ruby. That sounds nice. Where's the, uh, this? Fool's gold. They hit a gold mine, literally. Another mark a few minutes walk away. Or not. Depends on where you are, really. Please read this note while next to Holly Fire Lane between Ambrose Street and Freedom... You'll be pleasantly surprised. Are there any in Advent? Grimhaven, Grimhaven, Overside, Shells. Here's Western Advent. Like, I want to see what these are. Western Advent, Purity Road, south of Hurricane and Vinland. Where is that? Washington, Ch Chack, Walnut, Forefathers, Benevolent, Hawthorne, Powder, Purity, Oak. What? I don't even see these. Western Advent, Purity Road, which is right here. South of Hurricane, Hurricane, I don't know how, how to say that word. Ambrose. I don't see Venland. Am I just blind or what? Yeah, I guess I'm just not sure how many of these things I really want to try and do, you know? M maybe there's a secret ending if you do all the side quests. I don't really know. But, I mean, I'm definitely not doing all of them, even if I did just do a few of them. Oh, look at that. I don't think I've seen that before. Oh, I can't pan the screen up. I want to see its face. Lame. Let's go this way, actually. Oh, I meant to go this way. Whoop. Okay, well, I think I decided. I am not going to... If I'm not going to com complete all the side quests, I guess what's the point in doing any of them, to be honest, right? Wait, did it always look this big? Or is it bigger? And... Have more like spikes? I don't remember that. Ooh, 
look at this. Now that is cool. Some kind of a an eclipse. I guess. Do I have a mind palace thing? There's an event that restarts. Katina's preventing the people of Oakmont from leaving the city. Hmm. I'm just like perplexed why there's no kind of dialogue about why the sky is green. Why is there an eclipse? Why is this rock so much bigger than it was before? And uh, why can't I find the entrance to this church? St. Michael's Church. Now, I'm assuming I probably have to go back down into the basement. Oh, no. Sounds like a big one. Here it comes. Thundering down. Let's just hit it again. Goodness sakes. I'm really bad about blocking myself in in a corner like this. All right. Where are you? There's like little shadow salty armadillos or whatever these are. Get out of here. Get out. Okay. Charles Reed is tripping. Okay, well, this place is still on fire. I'll take that. Um, I don't know. Should I check for loot real quick before I go down? I thought there might be somebody here to, like, I don't know, talk to me. But there's not. There's nothing. Nobody. Oh, I got a whole hand grenade. So... I think I want that. If we're going in for a battle, which I'm not sure that we are, but... At this point, I don't know. Here's some more loot. Let me... Heal. Then I can probably craft another health kit. And I cannot do another bomb. But I can do more of these. Okay. Okay, I don't know. Is this what we do? It is. Oh boy. What? How did we get under the water? The sea is calling. I guess some I guess that was supposed to be the entrance to Tiganar, I guess. It's a like a warp point or something? Not really sure. Great, it's my favorite place to be. I just want to figure out, there we go, that's what I want. Hey, look. Oh, look. These are sunken buildings. Wait, is the city underwater? Whoa. What is that? What are those? Like fingers. Okay. T 
two underwater sections in one episode. Who knew? I'm looking for, like, creepy monsters out in the water, I guess. Uh... Okay. Why'd the music get scary? Please no, please no, please no. Okay. No thanks. You gotta walk over these things when they're not active. Ooh, ouchie. Get out, get out, get out of here. So the, it looks like the path wants me to go that way, but what's this way? Like, I wonder if I would get hurt if I just fell. That's probably it. That's probably where I'm going. I thought there would be more giant sea creatures down here. Oh, no. I know that music. Ah! Ah! No! It's my worst enemy. Charles, we gotta climb. We gotta climb. Pressurize. Aha! I wonder if the little guy that gives me such a hard time will grow into this eventually. Holy smokes. Like the crazy? Holy smokes. The crazy thing is, is that I don't think that these are like absurdly large. Like, I think there are creatures, sea creatures that are this big, right? Look at its, uh... It's Cthulhu. And there's giant sea creature tentacles that are practically touching my head. Oh, look at all the bones. Why is it doing that? I'm back in... I'm back in the... Wait, where am I? Yeah, this is where I started. I'm back in my boat. Where the whole mission started. Because I remember this. The place is trashed, and it's clearly... Off... Balance. We have a mind palace. Hold on. There's an event that restarts. The monoliths are small, visible parts of the prison Atiganar and have some mysterious function. Okay. The dreamer's hidden daughter is still imprisoned. If the prison opens, mankind will likely die. Mm, the there's a possibility that the daughter can be can spread her influence through the monoliths so she's spreading her madness and these don't match with each other the daughter's influence will be strongest inside Katiganor. whatever transformation awaits may be worse than death the daughter's influence will be strongest inside Katiganor. With her help, I could gain power beyond belief. What? I don't know about that. I really feel like Charles Reed's death is going to happen. If I restart the cycle, Oakmont will be destroyed, but mankind will be spared. See, I kind of like that idea. Because... Oakmont is a pretty horrible place anyways. Why would I even want to save this place? But at least mankind would be saved. You know what I mean? Do I jump? I'm supposed to jump? <gasps> Wait a minute. What is happening? 
now I'm in my hotel room, except it's trashed. And there's no fish to guide me. I can't. It's a shame you'll die here, Reed. This city has far worse men than you. Whoa. That scared me to death. A lot of people want to leave Oakmont, kid. Few ever succeed. Oh no, is it just gonna show me all the people that I've murdered this whole game? I want none of this to be real. To wake up in my bed in Boston, eat real food, drink good coffee, and forget it all. Oh man, that's me. I go outside? Now where am I? Let me be frank. You ain't welcome. You slip up, don't cross a T, or dot an I, and I'll treat you like every other criminal in here, newcomer. Oh no, my battery's low. What's going on in this town? Please help me die. I can't. I... Who are these people? I just can't. This is madness. No mercy, boys. He's been asking for this. Oh my God. It's a nightmare. And what is this, a throne? There is nothing more vile than futility. Watching this happen again and again and doing nothing. We are the agents of change, Mr. Reed. The Yellow King. My God, what now? Where are we? Please hurry, Reed. We can still save this city. That was that alchemist you professor. Can't end the suffering. The cycle will go on. You can't change who you are. I mean, that might be. Forgive me, father, for I have sinned. That's, uh, Mr. Carpenter, Jr. <laughs> We're doomed to rot in this bog. Jeez. I think that might have been the fisherman. There is a cycle. This has all happened before. She wants to be free, but she must not be, or else it all ends. This is all very interesting. Who is that? Why is there a body in the air? Is that me? Oh god. I think that's me. What is that? Okay, so now we're in... Some kind of a... Destiny waits for no man, Charles. Decide now whether this ends in salvation or blood. That's my question, though. Is it salvation for the daughter, whoever that is supposed to be, or is it salvation for humankind? Oh, look. Why are there two? Wait a minute. Yeah, why are there two? And then there's a door over here. Maybe I do all of them? I have no idea. Okay, what is this? Enough is enough. I'm leaving this damn city and its madness behind. That's me. I will not choose. I'll break the cycle and free all of us trapped in Oakmont. Wait. 
um Enough is enough. I'm leaving this damn city and its madness behind. So that's him leaving. I will not choose. I'll break the cycle and free all of us trapped in Oakmont. I will not choose. I don't know enough what happens if enough. I do this. I'm leaving this damn city and its madness behind. What does that mean? Hold on, I'm scared. Okay, so that's if I... That's if I don't choose and if I just leave the city, I think. So let's see what happens uh, if I do this one. I choose annihilation. The end of all cycles. Let everything die. I accept my fate. Unlike the cowards who came before me. My hidden daughter. I am coming. Okay, so this is... I choose annihilation. If I kill humanity. I my fate. Unlike the cowards who came before me. My hidden daughter. I am coming. And then we have a third option. I have made my choice. I willingly sacrifice myself like every seed before me. What is one life worth against all of humankind? And so this is if I save humanity. Let the cycle restart. And then we jump. Or fall, I guess. He's backwards. I have made my choice. Let the cycle restart. These are tough choices. So, do I have a mind palace? The cycle will repeat. Katiganar is preventing people from leaving Oakmont. I found the hidden control panel in Katiganar. It seems like it could reopen Oakmont to the world, letting people leave. Previous seeds died when they entered Katiganar. It seems like the seal could be used to release Katiganer's hold from on the city, allowing people to leave. The previous seeds died and the cycle kept repeating. The seed sacrifice must be the only way to restart it. Okay, so we've got... If I save mankind... And... Um, become some kind of a monstrosity, I guess. In this, if I enter the gate, I'll free the dreamer's hidden daughter. If I survive that, what's left of me won't even be human. The only way to prevent mankind's destruction is to restart the cycle by my suicide. Great. Or, hold on. What does this do? There's no sense in sacrificing my life. One way or another, someone will end the cycle and the hidden daughter will be free. By entering the gate, at least I have a chance to survive. Maybe I'll even become something greater than human. But wasn't there a third option? Aha. And here we go. If I enter the gate, mankind will be destroyed. If I commit suicide, the, cy the cycle will restart, delaying the inevitable. My only choice is to break the cycle. Maybe I can use... Kaiganar's control panel to open the city borders and escape with the sea. Wait, that's an option? I like that. Because if I leave with the seal, it would open the city's borders and I could escape. The cycle won't be restarted and I won't die. Like, that's plus, 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 right? I like that option. Is that what I do? That was this in here. 
Because that's breaking the cycle. Take the seal and escape. Restarting the cycle is useless. There's no sense in postponing one day. Okay. Yeah. I think I like this option. Okay. That's my choice. We're gonna flee the city. And... Whoa, look at all those hand marks. And maybe it'll work. And maybe it won't. I don't really know. Here we go. Oh yeah, look at that. That's the look of freedom. What's gonna happen? Austin a few years later. Oh look, it's me, I'm alive. I grew a beard. What could be happening? Oh my God. Catastrophic flood. Uh oh. Wait a minute. Did I make a bad choice? <laughs> oh god, that was the end of the game. I think I might have flooded the whole world. <laughs> Okay, so, so putting, so fleeing with the seal didn't prevent the cycle from happening again. I mean, I guess I survived and people were able to leave Oakmont, I guess. But, but then Boston was flooding and then the Yellow King, he was like patting my shoulder like, nice try, but nope. <laughs> I mean, that's what I got out of the, the little shoulder pat there. Nice try, but nope. Wow. I didn't... Re I guess I didn't know I was going to have the third option. But that sounded like a better option than the other ones. I mean, am I wrong? But the other choices, I could have sacrificed myself to close the gate, I guess, and have the cycle start again in you know well, however long it is I don't know if I forget whether it was a hundred years or more than that or I could have just destroyed all of mankind which that just seems a little bit extreme I think if anything if I hadn't chosen the one that I did choose I think if anything I would have probably chosen to restart the cycle so that Oakmont would be destroyed, but humanity would be spared. Because, I mean, why destroy the whole rest of the entirety of mankind because one city is plagued every, you know, century or whatever it is? That seems a little extreme. There's a lot of people on the planet, a lot of a lot of other cities in the world that don't have anything going on like that. Just so happens that every cycle, there's gonna be more, you know, a handful of people that are drawn to the city to try to open or close the gate. And then, you know, a whole city of people will be drowned. But at least not the whole world. I thought that was a really interesting game. I really love the feel of the game and the vibe and I like doing the side or the investigative stuff but the game is clunky and it's glitchy so and combat really sucks so i think i would give it like a three out of five stars would i replay it nope but i'm glad i played it i really liked it and i really enjoyed the soundtrack 
That was fun. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and uh, thanks for watching. And I guess up next, it's uh, October now, so I think I'm going to start some kind of a spooky game. Not scary, just kind of, just kind of spooky to go with the Halloween vibe. All right, guys. I appreciate you being here, and I appreciate you supporting my channel. I'll see you in the next series. Goodbye. Hey everyone, Brittany here with Desert Bee Games. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video and you'd like to help my channel grow, all you gotta do is hit the like and subscribe buttons below. Thanks again, and I'll see you next time for more.